<laughs> Splash of water in my face. Do it. <laughs> uh, right. oh. On the highest texture setting, there are floating pieces of cloth on some of the sails. These will be the Wailing Barnacle, Order of Souls, Burning Blade, and the Sail of the Silent Barnacle. And on the Xbox sails, this little corner ain't attached to anything other than a little bit of a hint of a nitpick. On the sails of the Ancient Gold, there is one little spot here where a pebble seems to have gotten through. Maybe it's supposed to be like that. And on the Shark Hunter sails, there is a penis. Wait. There's a second pipe on the tavern roof? What? Do we finally have a smoke tunnel that actually works and makes sense? <sighs> nah. Some of you said that the way the anchor works does not make sense. Not in that there is no actual physical anchor, but in a way that when you drop it, the boat does not stop until it's all the way down, but it does not start moving again until it's all the way up. That is just good game design. Still not sent there is a peeled banana on the season 5 title screen. But we don't peel bananas. What is real anymore? Who peels a banana? But there's an achievement. We're never given the option to peel a banana. Are ants smarter than humans? The only purpose our fingers have is to pull the trigger. Travis on Twitter told me that the new collector Spartan sales hand guards are backwards. And he is correct. If you were to hold it like this, you'd have the sharp edge of the sword towards you. That's just not nitpick. Many of you have pointed out to me that the map table on the galleon does not actually touch the floor. You see, there's a little space. Okay. In all the taverns, there are plates on the tables and frying pans behind the counter. But there is no way for the staff of the tavern to cook the food other than a little campfire that is outside. You would not expect a chef to come out here to cook food for their customers every time an order comes in. Unless they do the cooking somewhere else. While sailing on the Sea of Thieves, you can come across shipwrecks. And some of you probably already know that crashing into one of these shipwrecks does not inflict damage onto your ship, and probably thought this was a bug. But in the Sea of Thieves comic, specifically issue number two, you find out that this is just a nitpick. How does a piece of paper know when you've solved the riddle? That's just silly. Seeing as there's a moon in Sea of Thieves, and the fact that we don't have a high or low tide, that means the moon must be standing perfectly still in the sky but it does it rotates around that means that this is a nitpick the ocean's waves always goes towards the southeast regardless of the wind direction you can have wind coming from the southeast and the waves will still be going against it ow okay the water tower Right? This is where the people of the outpost gets their water from. There's even a tap for where the water comes out. But there is no water up in here. There's never been water in here. And even if this actually did collect water, there is no hole for the water to go through into the tap. And even if the tap did work, this design is horrible. I mean, why make a slanted roof on a water tower, minimizing the chance of water actually being collected in it? And this side hatch is a cool idea. Yeah. If it was not blocked off completely on the inside, nitpick. Ow. How come you can fire any of the weapons underwater? The gunpowder on your piece is gonna be way too damp to ignite. Stop it. Where are the baby animals? What's going on here? Do they all just appear adult? Where is my piglet? Why is the pig's tail not curly? Hold up. While pigs often have straight tails, often, not always, there is bound to be one curly tail out there somewhere. Tweet me at the genie if you find one. Until then, nitpick, we good? Okay. Nothing? Alright. Who buries all these chests? Does someone in the world start digging down the chest the moment I purchase a void? Okay. Okay. I get it. No more nitpicking. It's too much. This could go on forever. Can we at least agree that the anchor is not centered? Hey, thank you. But the biggest mystery of all, though, from the entirety of these three videos, why has all the taverns, all seven of them, gone through the trouble of making a second floor only to remove all access to whatever is up there? The only evidence of what the upstairs could have looked like is from a 2018 concept art from Aiden Wilson, where the 
their tavern interior design was way more open. Who knows why Rare decided to block it off. Only time will tell what they're truly hiding up there. But here's what I think is most likely hiding up there. Probably some smoke to the chimneys. Thank you.